this flooding in North Carolina does not sit well with me. I think something's going on. So I decided to do some digging. So the first thing I find out is North Carolina has the richest deposits of lithium in the entire world. Yeah, lithium for like cars, batteries, all that. Then I find out they have the world's highest purity quartz deposits. And that quartz just so happens to be the world's supply for AI chips, microchips, and all kinds of stuff. We're talking a $530 billion industry. So this is where it gets interesting. So a company by the name of Piedmont Lithium is awaiting a state mining permit for a site in Northern Gaston County. And Gaston County is completely flooded right now. The project was awaiting zoning approval because they were getting backlash from the residents and also city officials. And this lithium mine they want would be the third largest producer of lithium in the world. And they made a deal with Tesla already. Now remember the quartz? So in Spruce Pine, North Carolina, right next to Ashland, they are wanting to expand their mines even larger and the residents aren't having it either. Enter the floods. People, these are mountain towns. It rarely, if not ever, floods in the mountains. I would know I grew up in the mountains in Colorado, which means none of these people have flood insurance. I mean, the media is saying biblical devastation in North Carolina, AKA like the worst thing that could happen. And you're not coming back from it. Read between the lines, people. Everything happens for a reason.